Okay. <coughs> so again, been buying up whatnot, and this is from Lim. I think the name is Limited Edition on whatnot, and they basically just sell comics and comic covers. And I was just, I got carried away with bidding on stuff. I'm not sure how many are in here, but let's have a look. See what we got. Some of these I may end up putting up for sale myself. Some may go into my own personal collection as I'm collecting a lot of stuff now. Yeah, so limited edition right there. I know I'm showing the price, but I can cover whatever is needed. Limited edition comics and collectibles. Thank you for your order. See you again soon. There's their website if anyone wants to go check it out. They're really cool, um, they're good, they do the bits nice and quick, so that they don't, they just don't waste time, it's, it's nice to see. Uh, let's, let's peel these out. So we've got three to look at, so let's have a look. Oh yeah, oh these are the Star Wars ones, wait, wait are they actually comics, or were they just art? Okay, so they are actually comics, that's pretty cool. So we got Star Wars The High Republic, I think this one is. Uh, we also have War of the Bounty Hunters and Jabba the Hutt. And we have this one. Again, I only spent like one, two pound on these. With shipping, shipping was two pound seventy, I think. So overall, wait, let me have a quick look. Yeah. So I spent five pound on all three of these, and then spent two seventy on chipping. So I spent spent seven seventy for like Star Wars ones, which to be honest are just gonna go into storage. Um, but even brand new, they're worth uh four dollars. Okay, that one was free by the looks of things, but still still cool. And then that one was five dollars. So I feel like I've, I have got a bargain out of these, and especially because it is Star Wars, like I really think it looks cool. So yeah, more stuff we've been buying. Tell me what you think, and tell me if you've been buying any comics recently, and what type of comics that you may have been buying.